So this this dude right here, I've worked with him for like since we were like 10 years old. But uh, this is the first time we've ever fished together. So shout out to you, Ty, for letting me come to your your juice spot. Yeah, I thought I might as well try it right here real quick. There's one. Oh, that was fast. That was a beast of a hook set. Just saying. <laughs> I'm Ben, by the way. PB? Yeah. Okay. Works for me. Dude, I haven't, I've been fishing, I've fished like 10 times in the past month, have caught absolutely nothing. This feels like so good. <laughs> All right. Pretty nice little bass. Actually, it's like only a pound, but it's worth it. It's freezing cold too. All right, let's put them back. All right, well, we're five minutes into the day and we already broke off, so that's that's a good way to start. <sighs> oh, okay, and that, kids, is why you check your line when you catch a fish by rocks, because you will break off just like that. Kind of crazy, isn't it? No, it's not crazy at all. I'm just stupid. Okay, let's see if we have... Uh, this looks, actually, this looks better. We'll use this one. Take off that trailer. And put on one of these bandido bugs. I like these because they're natural on one side, blue on the other side, so it's just pretty cool. Yeah? Why, why? Like, why do people care? I don't get why people... I just don't get why people care if you fish a neighborhood pond. Like, what are we gonna do? I've probably caught a five or six. I don't know how big it is. Yeah. I like that rock over there. That just, that looks good. This side, like, drops south. That side is really slow. Okay. So this is a steep drop off. You ever get a backlash and then you just see the fish like start running with your line? No, I, I put them in trees. Right? <laughs> How? <laughs> How? Yeah, yeah. I'm it's good with me. Where is it? It's like a fucking puddle, but it always forty five. Really? I don't know how. Alright. Good with me. Where's it at? Uh, okay. Yeah, well. Currently, we're fishing a freaking puddle, but these are juicy. Come on. I mean, you caught one. There's got to be another one. But I'm yeah, I'm not a fan of this massively disgusting bottom. All right, so as you see here, I have my nice SLX, a good reel, a good smooth reel, it gets the job done, which is very practical. And then we go over here and we basically have um, a Saudi Arabian prince's reel that Ty feels in need to bring to ponds. Um, yeah, I just want to show that because it's kind of ridiculous. That's what I thought. <laughs> Alrighty, so we're at a neighborhood that I am way too poor to even look at. But we're here anyways, so uh Oh yeah, no, definitely not. Oh yeah, I got I got a puppy and I got little brothers, so I don't I don't leave stuff around. Well, she wants to hook in her mouth. Oh 
Oh, Ooh. My gosh. yeah. It's not fun. Can I pet him? Yes, yeah. He's he is adorable. Hi, buddy. Hi. Hi. Oh, you need attention. They both need attention. Hi. It's been a tough adjustment. <laughs> hey, if you're if you're the big dog and then you have a little little baby. Um, not quite three months. Yeah, I was gonna say he's very little. Yeah, he's real little. Yeah, oh. He's still in the body fit. Yeah. What's his name? His name is Tucker. Tucker and that one's. Hers is Valen. She's a right. she. We rescued her. Oh, okay. Tucker. We're supposed to be going to the bathroom. <laughs> All right, I'll leave you to it. Yeah, but don't worry, I don't leave anything behind. That's not how I roll. I don't want to get over there those, but you keep going close. <laughs> uh, Alrighty, it is 3.19, and oh, we're going to head over to the next spot, which might be my last because i got to get home pretty soon. Got to leave like at 4.30 or 5. Um, but yeah, having a good time. Caught one bass. Honestly, don't know if we should have left that first spot because... That was kind of juicy. They caught like five bass and I pulled up and caught one right off the bat and then had one break me off. So, um, yeah, I don't know, but we'll try out this spot and I will see you there. All right, next spot. So what are the chances we get kicked out of this place? None? Really? All right. Okay, cool. All right, boys, this place Looks juicy. I can't believe I've never been here before. All right, it's 424. We have, or I have like 30 minutes. We gotta leave at five. So uh, let's catch some fish. Where are we? <laughs> this is an, what? Yeah, I can tell. Hey, just so you know, I'm not a bad driver. But, uh, I was like, I'm, why did we go all the way around? I don't know. I don't know why. Yeah. So, man, I thought we got off on the one spot. All right, buddy, he's taking us to a pond in the middle of nowhere. Um, probably going to catch a six pounder because my GoPro is about to die. So, we're going to. Um, call him, bud. Yeah, I didn't know. Uh, <laughs> that's his dad's name? <laughs> no. <laughs> no. I, I, I just. I don't know. All right, but anyways, gonna reserve the GoPro battery for a little bit. All right. Did you get on there? What? Did you, were, did you hop on there? Yeah. Oh God. Oh shit. And that is where that video is going to end. GoPro died, so I couldn't film an outro. Um, but yeah, nothing else really happened. We didn't catch any more fish, so we just went home. And now I'm editing this video up. Uh, hope you enjoyed it. Um, finally getting out on the water more, which is exciting because I don't have to sit inside all the time. And yeah, I caught one fish, which is better than I've been doing. So you got to give me props there, right? Uh, thanks for watching. As always, drop me a like, comment even, and I'd love it if you subscribe. You know what I'm about to say. Fish hard, learn more. I'll see you in the next video.